Hi, uh, we're just going to go through quickly how we can get uh, Google Analytics e-commerce tracking on our uh, OpenCart installation. Uh, first thing is we need to uh, get the Google, Google Analytics Pro module from the OpenCart market. You can go to OpenCart market, go to modules, Google Analytics Pro. Uh, it has some screenshots here, the price, uh, some information. Once you've got that module, just follow the PDF instructions on how to upload it. After you've uploaded it, you'll see it in your extension modules list, Google Analytics Pro. Uh, one thing you want to do here is maybe just before we go through this, you want to go into your store and make sure here your Google Analytics code, just, just delete anything that you've got there currently. Uh, the Google Analytics Pro module takes care of standard tracking plus e-commerce tracking. Uh, so if we go back to our module section, we have our Google Analytics Pro. I've already installed it. Uh, we click on edit. Uh, if you're unsure of what your, your profile ID is, you can click this link here and it'll show you. Uh, this is a, a test ID that I've got set up with a test account. Uh, you can see here that I've inserted the module onto every layout of the site. It's very important. The absolute most important though is to have it on the checkout page. That's where we're going to start picking up the uh, e-commerce stats. So you see, all you've got to do, use the profile ID and then put on every page. And that's the settings, that's all it is. There's no file editing, file editing or anything like that. Uh, it's a very simple module, easy to use. What we'll get out of that, and I'm just gonna load up a, a test account here that I've got. Uh, this is not uh, anything more than just some dummy data that I've put through. Uh, we've got our basic tracking, you know, the, the data's low here, I'm just for an example. Uh, so the standard track, tracking is coming through, giving us our, our sources, everything like that. But you'll see here, we've now got e-commerce tracking. And this is the, the really cool bit, is that we can drop into this section now and we can start pulling out stats on, uh, on products, order values, transactions, conversion rates. I mean, it's just amazing the amount of data we can pull out here. Uh, we can start drilling down into our, our most profitable products or the highest selling products. Uh, all kinds of useful data. You can set up funnels here that interact with your e-commerce tracking so you can see uh, the checkout process all along, how it's working and, and, and where the uh, transactions are coming from, where they're dropping off. Uh, another, another a really highly useful feature I think is that if you go into your traffic sources, what uh, the e-commerce tracking does is it adds an extra dimension to these sources. So let's say we go to all sources and we want to see, uh, it's obviously showing us our, our top sources, which are very low, obviously, test, test website. But now we can click on the e-commerce tab and we can see those sources, what they're actually pulling in in revenue. This is very important. This is one of those things where once you see it, you, you can never go back without it. If you're running advertising campaigns or link building with another website or anything like that, this will show you whether those sources of traffic are actually producing any revenue. Because let's face it, there's no money paying for uh, Google Ads or anything like that if all you're getting is, is visits and no revenue or no, no conversions out of it. So this is one of the key things about it is you can start to break down all your standard analytics data and start seeing what it's actually bringing in in terms of sales. It's very important. Okay, well that's it. It's a very simple module. You can get it from the uh, open cart market, uh, $24.95, and this is the great data that it produces.